Hello friends, welcome to the Photoshop tips and tricks. Let me show you how to manipulate glow effect in Photoshop. Let's start. At first select the layer. Then select object selection tool. Zoom in the key. And select it. When it's selected, press Ctrl J to make a copy layer, and rename it key. Then select this layer. And select the hand. If selected, select lasso tool and zoom in here to fix the selection by adding these parts. Hold Alt and deselect here. Again, add here to your selection. OK. Now press Ctrl J to make a copy. And rename it Hand. Right click on this layer, and convert to Smart Object. Add a group. And name it Key Effect. Drag the key layer into group. And change the mode to Linear Dodge. Click and drag to duplicate the layer three times. Select this layer, then go to Filter, Blur, and Gaussian Blur. Set the radius to 7 pixels, and click OK. Duplicate this layer, and double-click on Gaussian Blur. Increase the radius, set it to 70 pixels, and click OK. Again duplicate this layer, and double click on this effect. Set the radius to 200 pixels, and click OK. Duplicate one more time this layer, and double click to edit. Set the radius to 550 pixels, and click OK. Close the group. Now go to the second image. I work on this, right click on the layer, and convert to smart object. Then click and drag it to the first image. Press Ctrl T to scale the size, and adjust the position. Change the mode to linear dodge. Right click on the layer and choose rasterize. Select lasso tool and select here. Press Ctrl T, then right click, and choose Warp. Then adjust it like this. Again apply the process on this part. That's well. Select the layer, and add a layer mask. Select the brush tool, make sure the color is black. Right click on this thumbnail, and choose select pixels. The hand selected, change the color. Increase the opacity and the flow. Then select the layer mask, and brush to remove here. Select the hand layer, then click on adjustments, and add color looks. Select this effect from the list. Click here to clip to layer, and come back to layer panel. Duplicate this layer. Change the mode to linear dodge. Set the opacity to 50%. Right click on the layer, and choose blending option. Drag this slider to right, then hold alt and drag to split the slider. Now click OK to done. Select this, and add a new layer. 
Right click on this and create clipping mask. Select the brush. Change the color to white and zoom in here. Set the opacity to 50%. Then change the mode to overlay. Now brush here to add the highlights. That's well. Decrease the opacity, set it to 55%. Zoom in here again. There is some black edges. To fix them, select the layer mask, then select the brush, change the color. Decrease the brush size and brush to remove. Increase the opacity to 100%. Then easily remove the edges. Select these four layers and group them. Then rename it to hand. Select this layer and go to the third image. Click and drag it to the first image. Adjust the size and position. Change the mode to color dodge. Duplicate the layer. Then click on adjustments and add hue saturation. Click to clip the layer. Then increase the saturation and drag to left the hue slider. That's well. Come back to layer panel. Select these three layers and group them. Then rename it to Butterfly. Look the final result. And this is done. Hope you liked it. Please follow me on social media for more useful and effective videos. Thanks for watching.